having uh, spoken before, I've been through another dead battery shutdown and uh, took that opportunity to have a good deal of sashimi and of warm tongue, hot tongue, Rinderzunge, beef tongue. It's a favorite of mine. Mother, daddy brought home and mother made a few times in my childhood tongue and it was rare and uh, interesting. <laughs> in any case, it's, uh, it's a favorite meat of mine now. And as I'm looking at needing to or being pressed to uh, manage my eating habits, particularly of carbohydrates. Uh, ah, low battery already. Um, in connection with uh, managing my blood sugar level. Just a new challenge on the road to death. But anyway, it is sort of downhill, although. <laughs> that leads perhaps to fear of falling more than to uh, appreciation of the, of the easier walk. <laughs> There's nothing you have to do in order to continue to deteriorate, go downhill. Uh, like, there's no reason to be happy. There's plenty of reasons to uh, be less able and so forth than before. Just along the lines of reasons go with unhappiness. Anyway, I'm kind of happy to have eaten a good bunch of sashimi. I'm uh, <laughs> like a rich man, which I'm not um, turning a, a luxury into a into a staple. It's sort of today I ate a quarter pound of of um, I think quarter pound of tuna sashimi and a little bit of lox salmon, which is. Gabi prefers, my roommate prefers. Anyway, <laughs> and uh, glass noodles, having got eight packages, not nine, eight packages from Penny with the help of a store employee. When I found the shelf empty and I asked, uh, it was lovely. 39 or 49 cents for a hundred grams that brings it well within the range of uh, less than one one penny per gram uh, being a reasonable price for food and more than one penny a gram being a luxury price for food <laughs> my last batch of blueberries was two cents two cents a gram. There were some pretty good big ones. In any case, 125 grams for 249. I had misunderstood, I think, the pricing by by the 40, by the 50 cents or so, but I thought it was 199. But still, that's expensive, even for blueberries from Peru. But they were good. I love them. And there's a report from somewhere that they're good, good for what ails you. I find them good for what ails me, so <laughs> you probably are. Ah, well. So, sashimi and glass noodles and uh, rinderzunge. Um, I bought a good batch of it, and I've just stuffed the rest of it that hasn't been cooked yet in two batches, stuffed what the rest of it into the freezer. 
so it'll be warmed up at a future date. I should have divided into, well, whatever. Doesn't matter. <laughs> it's whatever's left. I think it may be only a 125 grams or so. That's like one serving, quarter pound plus. Anyway, <laughs> still low battery at five and a half minutes. Oh yeah, I'm drinking my health to uh, probably some of the last sugared uh, limonade, citronin limonade, uh, lemon flavored soda, which I will drink up even though I'm uh, today bought three bottles of sugarless and two bottles of sugarless cola and just to be a little funny one bottle of um, lime soda that purports to have four grams of sugar per hundred milliliters instead of 9.9 .9 or whatever the others are so I just bought it just because it's a uh, in between. <laughs> I know I've got to cut back on my sugar intake, so nevertheless, I am going to use up the. Uh, I guess it's two bottles of sugared soda left in the fridge. Maybe it's three. I don't know, but anyway. At most three, and at least for the near future, as things proceed with my managing blood sugar, uh, chances are I won't have any more sugared sodas in the house for s some time, maybe forever. So, farewell to sugary limonade what else nothing else bye namaste